interesting question isn't it because when you put your business head on and somebody comes for a job interview you would want to pay them and negotiate with them as an individual and if they are the best person for the job then rightly so so they should get the job and i think one of the areas is that once the business has taken it on they go amazing i've got that person for a steal and i've got this one i'm having, having to pay a little bit more and i'm balancing my line at the end but they're neglecting what their obligation is is to check because you might find that the majority of those people on the lower salaries are female and at that point you've inadvertently breached the law and the point is if you are recruiting somebody and you are prepared to pay the salary you've negotiated which is higher you then have an obligation to review the people who've been working and loyal for a long period of time otherwise we end up in a situation a little bit like where people stay with the same insurance provider and they keep putting your premium up and up and up it's your disadvantage to stay with somebody really as a business if you've spent all of that time investing on the person regardless of race creed or color then pay them what they're worth really because we need to change this concept of this victorian approach to running businesses with officers here and you'll do as i say there and i'll get i'll get this for whatever i want instead of running it like a military organization think of it more like an organic ground for growth because if you spent four years paying somebody and then you've been underpaying them and you say in your contract don't talk about salary why not talk about salary people should be paid what they're worth and if they're worth a lot to you and have been with you for a while and you should pay pay where it's deserved and i think some of it has come from ignorance where it's that operational mindset of i need to always make sure the business is profitable and i'm getting a good return on my investment but you need to change your mindset now to actually recognizing that's a human being with value that's given you their time that's given you blood sweat and tears might have stayed late done all the processing and you actually being really fair by not paying them what they're worth and, and that, that's where i think sometimes people are underpaying people because if they're not speaking up then they're not getting what what they deserve and that's unfair and that's where the responsibility is on the business to actively review what they're paying everybody overall and if it does mean you need to increase salaries then so be it so it's time to wake up and recognize that people have value and you need to pay for it because long gone are the days where you can make people work 40 hours a week and not pay them for overtime and expect them to stay late or work through the lunches it's time to wake up and get with the modern age because those who fail to adapt won't survive for the future.